now at Florence Court Station, a beautiful little architectural gem. Although it's called Florence Court Station, this building is in fact situated in Letter Breen, just off the Sligo Road. Uh, the railway company wanted to cash in on the fact that, of course, Florence Court was the home of uh, the Earl of Inniskillen, hence the grand name of Florence Court. It was, if you like, a wayside halt, uh, not near any particular community as such, apart from the small community of Letter Breen. You might wonder where did the custom come from for, from Letter Breen? Well, Fermanagh Council had a tar depot here, so the council used it for, for road works and bringing in tar. Uh, the local firm of JJ Coulter, which was one of those old country grocery shops that sold meat, sold meal, sold everything. Uh, a lot of their supplies came to Florence Court Station and then were delivered to Coulter's themselves. Uh, my grandfather owned a farm nearby, quite a large farm. Uh, in 1909, they built a two-bay hay shed, uh, which came from Fishamble Street in Dublin, from Kennan's foundry. It came all the way by train here to Florence Court Station, and was then brought by horse and, horse and cart from Florence Court uh, to the farm at Capoc. Florence Court Station had, had one platform, as you can see behind. Uh, Archie Burns was the station master for many years, and eventually he was succeeded uh, by the two Galt brothers who formed th the staff here. Behind me also is the goods store, uh, which was kept busy. From here, the line crossed the road at, on the level crossing, and the signal box is the only building here at Florence Court that has disappeared. Uh, it was just beside the station before the level crossing. From here, the railway has been transformed because when the railway closed, uh, it was then metalled and became a roadway. And from here to Abo Hill Halt, uh, we can travel along the railway, now a road. Okay.